although the new Season 10 update to celebrate the fourth anniversary has only been out for a few days, the developers of Call of Duty Mobile have already revealed the first information about the current and next season in Call of Duty Mobile on their official Reddit page yesterday and we take a look at what we can expect in the game this year. After each new season update, the developers published a new community update on Reddit in which upcoming dates and the new content of the respective new season are addressed. In addition, we have the opportunity to post our concerns wishes or suggestions for improvement to the COD mobile team under this community update, which are kindly answered by the Call of Duty team from time to time. As we know, the Mythic Switchblade X9 is returning to COD mobile for the current season and may not appear in the game until the week after next. In the official community update, the Mythic Fustian Knight's Redux Lucky Draw was not listed among the upcoming events that will appear in the game from November 9th to November 17th, according to the developers. The Mythic Switchblade X9 Neon Legend will return to the game in COD Mobile with no voice line changes, meaning that the unique Japanese voice and its voice lines will not be removed. Here's what the Call of Duty Mobile team wrote on Reddit, Hey everyone! We just wanted to clarify that the voiceover for the upcoming Mythic Switchblade X9 will not be adjusted or changed on its re-release in Season 10 like we had mentioned it would yesterday. We double-checked with the team last night and they confirmed no changes there. Thanks. So now we have the official confirmation that the Mythic Switchblade X9 will appear in the upcoming Mythic Fustian Knight's Redux Lucky Draw without any changes to the voice lines in Call of Duty Mobile. Personally, I think it's good that the developers didn't change the voice lines because in my opinion the unique voiceover of the Mythic Switchblade is exceptional and it would be unfair to anyone who would have bought the Mythic Switchblade in the 4th anniversary. You are welcome to write in the comment function if you already have this Mythic Blueprint in the game or plan to buy this blueprint in the current season. If you want to take a look at the latest events starting next week you can click on the reddit link in my pinned comment below this video which will take you directly to the new season 10 community update for COD Mobile. The nail gun from Black Ops Cold War is available in Call of Duty Mobile and although it's really fun to make kills with this new weapon, there is currently a bug that doesn't allow us to unlock the Tiger Completionist combo. You can unlock the new nail gun in Call of Duty Mobile by going to the seasonal store called Dodds and Ends and getting the nail gun for a total of 15 Season 10 Mission Tokens. On the other hand, you can also save your Season 10 Mission Tokens because, according to the developers, a new seasonal challenge called Nailed It will be released on November 14th in which you will most likely be able to unlock the nail gun. However, this is not confirmed because the upcoming Nailed It seasonal challenge might also include a rare blueprint for the nail gun which you can unlock by getting enough kills with the nail gun. Although we can't equip attachments to the new nail gun, we're supposed to get 90 kills with full attachments, which is obviously impossible if we can't equip any attachments. On Reddit, the Call of Duty mobile team wrote the following about the current error with the completionist commos of the new nail gun. Hey there. Yeah, looks like that was an error on our end. The team is aware of this issue and working on a fix. Appreciate your patience on this. Under another question from a user on Reddit, the developers responded similarly, Hey there, yeah, that's an error on our end. The team is aware and should implement a fix for it soon. Thanks. The error has already been reported to the team and the developers are probably already working on a solution to this really stupid bug. And the developers have already revealed a first leak for the next season for Call of Duty Mobile. The next season, which will also be the last season this year and will take place in December, will, as always, feature the Christmas theme. This means that after the Halloween season in COD Mobile, the next season will feature a beautiful theme in the game. Personally, I'm a huge fan of the Halloween and Christmas seasons organized by COD Mobile because they give me more anticipation for the respective festivities. I really hope that in this year's Season 11 we will see one or two new Christmas maps that have not yet appeared in the game, such as the Winter Crash map from Modern Warfare Remastered. 
Of course I will upload a new video on my channel when news about the next season appear or are released. And according to the developers of Call of Duty Mobile, something about the Kurohana crate will probably finally come today in a few hours or tomorrow. Probably the legendary blueprint for the assault rifle will finally be revealed, which we have been waiting for for a very long time. In my next video I will publish the new information about the Kurohano crate tomorrow on my channel so activate the bell to not miss tomorrow's video. And that's it for the video. I hope you liked it and enjoyed it. If so, give it a thumbs up and if you're new to my channel be sure to subscribe and activate the notification bell. Don't forget to check out my other videos on my channel. Thank you so much.